Hello and welcome. My name is Amulli and in this video I'm going to show you how to install Python 3.6.264 bit on your Windows 7, 8 and 10 operating systems. So this is the Python website. Uh, please launch your browser. So I'm going to use, I'm already using Google Chrome. I assume that most of people use Google Chrome. So this is why. And to get Python, you go to python.org and launch it. And you can see this is the latest one, 3.6.2. To get the, the most latest release, Python release with 64 bit on Windows, you go to download and then you go to Windows. If you click here, this will be just 32 bit, okay? So because you want 64 bit, click on here. Once you click on it, this is going to be python.org downloads and that says windows you can see it here once you are there you'll see a lot of things here python releases for windows so look at this a long list these are the releases okay so you can choose any of these whichever one you want i'm going to click on here 3.6.2 just click on that that's the most latest one and then just go down you can also check the major new features of 3.6 release series compared to 3.5. Just go down and you will see these are the files, okay, download files. You can download web installer and executable installer as well and embeddable as well. So for this video, I'm going to only use Windows. That's going to be 64 bit executable install so just click on it and save wherever you want to i'm going to save it here you will see it here on the bottom so once it's done it shouldn't take long time so once it's done okay in the meanwhile let's go ahead and see on the top in case you do not need you do not want to install it offline you can try this one as well that's online you can get it from python anywhere that's the chargeable they will charge you like five dollars every month but you get a lot of features on it so let's go ahead and run the python 3.6.264 bit executable file on windows 10 just click on it and before you click install now make sure you have checked this add python 3.6 to path okay and then you say install now and on this prompt say yes you can see it's 64 bit so python for windows 64 bit you can check this one as well this is a very awesome thing here print i guess what happened okay Please subscribe to my channel. This is what I can see here. So this is how you can use online Python console, which is available here for free, but not freely available on Python anyway. They will charge you five dollars each month, like that subscription-based service. So Python is a very good language. I love it. If you're starting with Python, awesome. You go, you have good career because it's used in every sector and it's a cross-platform. That's the best advantage of using Python. And it's a mature language. That's another thing. So thank you so much for your patience. It's been installed now. I can go ahead and check a lot of things here. So go to start menu. You can check here as well. You'll get this Python ID. Idle, I'm sorry. You can check everything here as well. So this is going to be just in a moment here. If you just say print, print it, not print it. Okay, then you say world, and then say hello world. So it's working. You can do simple arithmetic as well. Okay, it works perfectly fine here as well. Mm. 
yeah thank you so then you want to check with the cmd let's go ahead and open cmd this is my cmd and then you say python you'll get python 3.6.2 this is 64 bit you can see it here and then you want to come back and try here as well you can say print i'm not sure if you it's going to work thank you for watching this video did not work why because you need this quote thank you so much for watching the video please like share and subscribe for the channel and have a good day that's it for the video so thank you have a good day bye so this is how you it works